So now we have got to the dime stage, which is a lot of fun. Um, we're going to do a simple tie-dye, which I'm sure a lot of people know, especially from their childhood, fun craft project. And the first thing you've got to do is just make simple knots in your t-shirt over the whole surface, like, like this one. And, um, right, you should do another one, do three, do that in a minute. Now we take a watering can and thoroughly wet the fabric all the way through. Now we're ready to dye. You take a pipette which you can buy at any craft store and decided to do three colours, orange, green and a lovely fuchsia. You take your dye and squirt it, it really get absorbed into the fabric. Do it randomly over fabric. Another colour. Many ways of dyeing. But this is the simplest. You can also dye by tying marbles all over the fabric. Which is called shibori dye. Pink. Do you have anything to add, Elaine, about dyeing? Um, you, the dyeing expert. I, after the... Uh, um, no, Ilana, I think you're doing a very fine job. How long does it have to... I think we take off the excess water and then we're going to put it in the sun to let it dry. And depends, we live in a sunny country, so it shouldn't take too long. Mm. And if you live in Canada? Uh, maybe you put it by the heater. Oh, okay. Gabby's going to love this. Oh, good. This one's a little thick. Okay. Orange. So we'll mush, mush it around. Add water to it. Add some water. The dye is um, this is dye that you use for silk, but you can use any dye, basically for tie dyeing. This is diluted. Actually. You can also have your kids help you with this. If you don't mind. A bit of mess. And we let you see the outcome.